a little bee, bee, bee. Hi, I'm Phoenix Hi. Rising. I'm Marco. Um, we're gonna do couples talk. This is the introductory video. <clears throat> to welcome you guys, you can click like, subscribe if you're not already subscribed. Um, we're going to, we were supposed to do it like weeks, weeks ago. <laughs> yeah, but you know, things happen. So um, we have free time now. We're gonna start. This is just the introductory. We're going to talk about narcissists and pretty much basic relationship problems and goals. Pretty much. So, um, I'm gonna give you the floor. I'm just gonna let you talk for a minute. You want me to let you talk? I don't know. Look at me. I never really film myself. You know, I usually just do the cards for you guys. So, um, it's more so as like, we're gonna speak for both sides. I'm speaking for the men in my experience, and she's gonna speak for the women in her experience. Yeah, so we'll talk about like ex husbands, ex wives, baby daddies, baby mamas, uh, narcissistic behavior from mates. Uh, what else we'll talk about? Um,. Being children of narcissistic parents, even though it's couples talk, it leads to things that have happened in a relationship because uh, either, well, both of us have narcissist parents, we, ne never mind if it's our mom or dad, but so, you know, and we have siblings that are narcissists as well. So we're going to talk about those things and children being narcissists that you're raising that you're not thinking about, um, narcissistic behavior. Um, I have... Uh, I, I want to share a majority of my experiences because I noticed that um, a lot of the damage that was done to me was uh, because I was in, um, in, a relation, in a marriage and then I have a child that displays narcissistic behavior and then I have a parent that displays narcissistic behavior. So we're talking a parent, a child, I couldn't escape it. So, you know, it affected me mentally because I'm an empath and the shit was really fucked up. So, yeah, we're going to be cursing a little bit, too, so I just want to let you guys know that. But, um, I guess we'll talk about how we met, and I said I was going to keep this under 10 minutes because this is just the introductory, but pretty much, um, like you said, yeah. And then narcissistic women, dating men, taking advantage of men. Um, what else I'm trying to think of? Okay, what else, what else, what else, what else? Am I missing anything? No, it's just, like, pretty much the overall scope of what relationships should be, could be, and what they are today. And the lack of love and empathy in this generation <laughs> and in the world period sometimes yeah so um but you know we'll, we'll take questions we're open to opinions um we're both Sagittarius's I don't know if that will make a big of difference some people would say it would but I don't think it should he's the first and I'm the 14th so um oh I guess we'll talk about a little bit of age gap because I'll be 39 this year and I'd be 35. So, you know, we'll talk about that because I'm the older woman, as people say. So, I don't know. I guess those couple years is a big deal. Um, and what else? Let's see. I'm trying to think. Is that it? I'm trying to make sure we cover everything. Yeah, you know, topics may vary because, you know, of new information being brought to light and, you know, watching things that's happening in the world. So, you know, it's a, a broad range of relationship topics that we may cover so oh and what i found interesting as a as an individual um you know you could get all the advice from a woman in the world about a man and some things will help and some things won't but what i did notice um going forward i really didn't have a male best friend so i would say that his input on previous relationships and then i think my input on his relationships we both noticed that the other person was being taken advantage of. Now, rather, I don't think I knew it. I knew for myself personally, and I don't think he did either. But it's amazing what another person of the opposite sex will notice that, you know, it's like uh, me telling him, like, oh, this bitch playing games. She's full of shit. And he's like, oh, this nigga on bullshit. And it's not no hate, and it's like narcissistic bullshit. You know, we'll cover those things. People using their children as pawns and games and shit. It's fucked up. So... Yeah, um, 
So, yeah, I just, you know, those are little things like that that I feel like need to come up now because it's a lot of things that I did majorly wrong with no guidance. So, um, Shit, me as well. And I just want to save you guys some time. You know, I know we're doing the, uh, the cards as well. So, you know, and then how I even got to doing that. And I guess he'll tell you how it feels to date the empath or tarot card reader because some people say that that's the bad thing. I will do that. Yeah, so stuff like that. You know, we but have a minute, so yeah. This is pretty much saying hello and welcome. And I guess we'll be back with our first video. Yeah, you can just roll across the ride one to the I'm so worried to you. You can ride the roller ride with it. About to make me a drink. We're about to talk some shit. Guess what? Like, I was going to all have his own channel. You forgot to watch your channel. You know, so yeah, I'll do it as well as my channel. It, it'll be a link on our channel. It's going to lead you to my channel. So, what the fuck? You want to eat your channel, so. Well, I think this is the only thing on my channel, so you can just click if you want to. Oh, yeah, check, check my music out. Five, way. five? Okay, I'm sorry. That was some misfaces and shit. So, pretty much done. And we'll go back with.